Whoa there. Now better apply the brakes unless you're aiming to dash yourself against that glacier up ahead. Where's the brakes? As you can see, Chief, the station here is iced over. To reach Eleanor Lamb at Fontaine headquarters, we'll have to clear the way. Now, in order to melt that ice, you'll need a plasmid like a handful of hellfire. We used to sell a fine old product called Incinerate in the amusement park up yonder. Go on and find a way in. I've already been on all the rides. Hey guys, welcome back to more Bioshock 2. I, I have to do something real quick. Uh, it's, it's just very important to me. Okay, we're done. Alright. <laughs> so welcome back to Bioshock. Uh, now we're going to the amusement park level, and I love amusement park levels in any game. It's quite possibly one of the best... I don't know, it's just... There's, there, there's so much fun you can have. It's because they're fun places. Amusement parks, that is. I love them. They're truly wonderful. Well, I don't want to stand by, so screw you. Alright, uh... Oh, we got some crates over here. Hidden items all over the place. Might as well take a look around. I oh, got sardines, really? Wow. Guess that would be a popular food in a first city under the ocean. They must get all the protein. Then how are they getting fat, I wonder? Because there's no carbs in, 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 in the ocean. Well, I'm sure there's some. But not a whole lot. Oh, I guess the alcohol, I guess. Well, uh... More Vita Chambers, of course. It's just, it's just, yeah, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I didn't play with Vita Chambers off, because, you know, you'd have to sit through this every time. Like, because that would be like saving, because the game was obviously not created for anything but Vita Chambers, so you'd be saving a lot, I'm just like, nah. I'm like, nah, I'll just, I'll just be a bitch and resurrect back to life. She's our salvation. She's a giant butterfly. Wait, is that like, is that like a picture? Get out of there. All right. Progressing brilliantly. My physical participation in her birth was minimized, of course. It is vital that I am unhindered by nature's crude bias. I will be, above all, her intellectual progenitor. Loyal not to her, but to the people she will ultimately save. But I admit, it is with some measure of pride that I review her marks in standard intelligence tests. As an agent of our beliefs, she may surpass even me. Oh, well, look at this. Of course, there's absolutely fucking nothing. Alright. Okay, he's dead. I love the drill. The drill is so fun. It's like, I don't know, you know, I've been kind of, ever since Crisis, I've been more into melee weapons, I won't lie. Ever since I, like, kind of just had so much fun with that. Especially when it, it involves speed. And you're probably wondering, like, Mike, there's no speed in this. And I'm like, well, you obviously haven't seen this game before, because you would know that there will be speed. The need for speed. I, I, I've i recently really taken a liking to speed, though. So, not not drugs, but, you know. Well, might as well Welcome be drugs. To Ryan Amusements. Insert your ticket now. Half price for children under three. Half price for children under three? Really? God damn it, Andrew Ryan. I like how, I like, how like his, his tapes though are like everywhere around the city. It's like fucking... There's no privacy. You're a rare old model, son. Alpha series, I believe. Now, Rapture's full of scientific wonderments just like you. And if we can sell them to the world at my price, well, curing your condition ought to be a cakewalk. Once we find Eleanor, the sky's the limit. Ooh. Ooh, a minigun. I want the minigun, man. I'm sure that I'm sure that will open at some point. I kind of forgot when. I did do a blind run of this. This is the only other time I played this game was I did blind run. All right. Drill damage increase. Uh, yeah. Do that. I, I love damage on my drill. 
I mean, I'm not really having any fuel issues, so fuck that. Unfortunately, you only get to upgrade things once. Uh, can we... Can I... I can't do this? I want the minigun. Damn it, the hell. Well, I'm sure I'll be broken at some point when I come back up here. I just have to be patient. Which I'm really not, actually. If you've watched my videos for long enough, you would know this. I was hired to engineer a park the likes of which no man has seen. Now all I do is watch over it like a grizzled sheepdog. My first line of mechanical puppets made the children here cool with wonder. But Ryan thought my vision was immature. Antiquated, he said. This place could have been something magical. But instead, he turned it into a school. No, a cathedral. Dedicated to himself. You know, wh why is the prospect of an underwater theme park the most fucking awesomest thing I've ever heard of? Oh, here we go. Hi. Now there's something there's something sparkling here. Oh, take it. It didn't even look like it was sparkling, it looked like a piece of paper. Jam dandy. That'll get you in the park. But buying incinerate's gonna cost Adam. It's a sort of genetic goo that lets you rewrite whatever God gave you. The little sisters carry the stuff, as you may recall, so you'll need to locate one. I heard whispering near the El Dorado Lounge. Have a look. Genetic goo, huh? Man, I'm actually using rivets for a change. Here we go. The minigun. And I can't equip any of these things. So now I have a minigun. Well, because why the fuck not? I want a minigun. Okay, let's, let's give it a try, just because I don't want to tease you guys. My screen shakes so much. Damn it. I won't lie, this weapon kind of sucks. Fuck it. The one-two punch makes its epic return. Everyone loves the one-two punch. Also, the drill is so much better. Oh man, I love the drill. Fuck that machine gun. Yeah, I'm probably, you know, I'm not even gonna lie, I'm probably not even gonna touch that shit. <laughs> I'm just gonna be like, machine, I'm gonna be like, drill, fucking gas. And, and the spear gun, obviously. For anyone who doesn't know, the spear gun is it's obviously the rail gun of this game. Something I am very obsessed with. Which is rail guns. Alright. So we cheated and got a ticket. You know, we're, we're, we are the enemies of capitalism. This is piracy, guys. Piracy of Rapture. I am Andrew Ryan. Welcome to Ryan Amusements. Please, enjoy the park. Alright, well, sports boost. Uh, so what's this one do? Fuck yes, I move slightly faster. Yes, that's what I want. I want to see moving faster. I like moving faster. Alright, so we got some more 50 caliber rounds. Just in case I want to 50 caliber something. Which I, on, I honestly I really don't. So these are kind of cool, so you can just uh, watch audio stuff. Andrew Ryan wakes one night while cruising the Atlantic in his steamliner, the Olympian. His sleep interrupted with a singular purpose. Here, he shouts to his crewmen as he wipes sleep from his eyes. Full stop. We begin building here. I like I like these little things. Refitted for heavy construction, the Olympian returns with a new cargo. A state-of-the-art submersible platform. Nicknamed the Sinker. Ferry supplies and workers to the sea floor, fathoms below. It's a like history of uh rapture. I'm kind of wondering why there's no subtitles for that. Alright, we're not going to look at that quite yet. We will, however. Take the fine gin. After the platform is secured, work progresses at an 
astounding rate. Designed to be the foundation of Rapture, workers toil around the clock to create the metropolis you see today. Ah, something about a platform. I feel like I'd miss something. Oh. Well, apparently that's it. Rapture has nothing else for me. I love the kids in Ms. Englert's third grade class, but boy, I had no idea what I was getting into. Volunteering to chaperone this New Year's sleepover party at Ryan Amusement. Donnie? Donnie, get down off that exhibit, and I told you, spit out that gum! You'll choke! <sighs> the kids' parents deserve a night off to enjoy New Year's, but I'm at my wit's end. Donnie, I told you! Danny sounds like a little shit. God. Kids in Rapture. Spoiled brats! They like playing Call of Duty or something, and going on things. Oops, whoa. No, no, no. I want to be a parasite. <laughs> what? Fuck you. There we go. You don't shock me. Fucking drill fuel? I like drill fuel though, so I can't- I shouldn't complain. So I can apparently buy new tra more trap rivets and that's really kind of pointless for me. Fuck you, health station. Alright, cool, it only takes two hits now. I love this thing. I love my drill. I probably shouldn't say that. Because that could be construed as a, a something else. But I do love my drill. Alright, well. Uh, let's go. Have, let's go. Wait. Uh, well, I have gift shop. Okay. Alright. Well, you said I'm not welcome here. Alright. Oh no, let's go to the gift shop. I, I want to wanna get a little souvenir for my, uh, whatever that... That whoever that kid is. Alright. Like how you could like kinda like do both things at once. I love you, Drill. You gotta hey their their weapons just go away, so you can't just loot them now. But why are they killing carrying around drill fuel though? Like shit, we just found that. All right. Used to be there was no margin in running the gift shop. I couldn't hardly sell off this tourist crap for a penny more than the cost of manufacture. Then I met a straight shooter named Sinclair, and he laid a sweet deal on me. Says he's got some hard luck folks down at Popper's Drop can whip up this junk at half the cost I used to pay. Yeah. I had to pick a needle or two out of the shipments, but all in all, nobody's the wiser. Yeah, I'm the one with you. It just felt like using trap bolts, okay? I like trap bolts. Sort of. I don't know if I like them. They're 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 just there, so you know. I'm not really using my weapons at all. Because I have I have the drill, man, the motherfucking drill. That's why it was the first upgrade, I'm like, hell. Everything else can wait. Cool, let's let's look at the, let's get our fortune told. So, you think you're getting out of here? Fucking shitty drill. Um that nah, shitty not drill. Fortune. Okay, let's get another one. Uh, perhaps in a past life you did something terrible to somebody. <laughs> he he's a condescending fortune teller. I want my dollar back. I'm gonna break it so I can get my dollar back. Okay. My dollar back. Apparently, I'm not getting my my two dollars back. So, oh well. What can you do? Happy. Ooh, they have cards here. Uh, they're all happy birthday. Apparently, people really celebrate take they take their birthdays very seriously in Rapture. Where's that music coming from? Huh. Well, someone's out there and needs to die, so we go handle that first. This lifestyle is a disgrace. <laughs> I love this thing. Just imagine all the fancy little upgrades we can get for the drill, man. Just imagine it. Imagine harder. All right. Well, we'll go. I miss some dosh over here. I don't. I don't understand like how 
there's so much loot. Because people will just pick it up. You know, it's... They've been here for a while. Well, let's go open this up. Not before going into here. Oh, it's a ladies' room. Well, I am a perfect gentleman and will not be going in there. But there might be loot, so I, I think I will be. Oh, what? Was this, this was not open. Okay, well, oh, hi. Do you really hate the toilet that much? You attacked it! Oh, it's used. I mean, the toilet did not deserve that. Also, you were in the wrong room, so I guess I'll just go into the ladies' room now. Not something I say very often, but hell, we're here. I know the surface, Eleanor. I spent half a lifetime there, in service of the common good. But then, I heard my own words twisted by fat old men squatting over the embers of Hiroshima. Were the modern world a patient in my care, I would diagnose it suicidal. On perhaps that point alone, Andrew Ryan is correct. Rapture is deliverance. Yeah, psychobabble. Well, I guess we're done here. Each of us has a moral duty to increase the common joy and ease the common pain. Alone, we are nothing. Mere engines of self-interest. Together, we are the family. And through unity, we transcend the self. Who's there? Ah, uh, just me. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, bro. Rohan. I don't have to text this. <laughs> how, how, how can anyone hate the drill, honestly? it's I think it's the, the one redeeming factor of the game, it really is. It's fucking great. Alright, what's over here? Who knows? Let's go here anyways. Bastard pile of junk! You broke it! Didn't you, Edna? Everything you touch turns to shit! Me? You're mean, Roger. It was probably your clumsy, fat hands that allowed you to it up. Typical fraud. Stay with. Drop that at once. It's priceless. Why is he? That was like the completely wrong thing to say. You're getting shut up. What? Seems like everybody's on the go these days. Everybody but you. You still haven't experienced Ryan Industries' new spring line of plasmids. Isn't it about time you got caught up? Evolve today. Why was that so much louder than everything else? Good job, game. It's kind of like, what the fuck was that? <laughs> well, we can go look at pick your plasmid and evolve. Oh shit, we need to. This way to the kitchen of tomorrow. Okay, I'll, I'll do that in just a minute. Oh wait, what? Yeah, this is the same thing you said to be in the game. What it? In what country is there a place for people like me? Well, you're dead. Well, I guess that's pretty much it. We lost another of the Alpha Series protectors today in testing. Somewhere outside the city limits, he simply vanished. For these men, Rapture has no walls. We must find a method of conditioning them against abandonment of the Little Sisters. Something physical. Possibly even lethal. The lab aides are starting to call them big daddies. Perhaps there's some genius to that. Bonded pairs, connected by a love that kills. So unfortunately, nope, I cannot buy it as of yet. Yeah, there are machines. Or something, I don't know, they, they, they sparked, that's all I know. Well, I guess the kitchen of tomorrow will have to wait until tomorrow. So I can see the kitchen of tomorrow. There's always the worst phrase, the, ki the, the, the something of tomorrow, like, what, like what, like, next day? Wow. That's great. I love stuff, getting stuff tomorrow. Okay, well, is it another one? Whatever, you can, you can just fuck off. 
The walls are peeing. No. Why? It, look, it's, it thinks I'm stuck. Like, like what, guys? Am I stuck? Like, oh shit. Oh, I don't know where to go. Oh, do I go into a stuff only room? Like, holy shit. No, there, there are places I haven't been. I can tell there's a fucking arrow at the top of the screen. Until you arrive, Father, I'm trapped here. Smuggling these gifts out is the most I can do to help. Anyways, yeah. So I'm a little frustrated because now the game the game is like treating me like an idiot and I don't really like when games do that. Or right, drill power. Do you prefer your combat up close and personal? Do I? Let's do that. In ethical psychiatry, we must account for <laughs> Eleanor Lamb speaking. Mom says I'm not to play with the other children. Because they're being raised on a diet of dog-eat-dog. Dog. I wanted to see these dog-eaters. So I waited until Mom was gone and went out to find one. And guess what? The dog-eaters wear human skins. It makes them look just like us. All right. There's a little sister head. To get the atom, you must deal with her big daddy first. He will not attack you. Uh, whatever. It's apparently going to be a difficult fight. Well, I could use some difficulty. Should I just fuck him up with my drill? I could probably just do like a shit ton of drill. But now that big daddy won't bite until you do. But to get to little sis, you gotta put the old boy down for good. Oops, wrong, wrong kind of thing. Is this overkill, guys? Come at me! What? That didn't do shit! Big Daddy fight! Well then, that was the easiest thing I've ever done. Take a breath, son. You did it. Just let her ride on your shoulders and she'll trust you like her own daddy. Alright, well, let's adopt. Why, hello there! I just killed your other daddy, now I'm your daddy now. What? We're in business. Now, there are corpses all over Rapture, and little dimples there can sniff out the atom on them. Find one. Make me. found one of those children at last. Filthy dress, all alone. I approached her, praying that it was my little girl. But she was gorging herself on blood from a corpse. It wasn't her. I stared, just, just reeling. And then that skinny, armored freak that took Cindy jumped me, shrieking like an animal. I escaped, but... Could Cindy have become one of those things? I've got to find her now more than ever. I've got to take the ear ears off. All right, let's get some more drill fuel because I love drills. I would drill anybody any day. Leave a comment if you want to get drilled by me and uh ungrateful parasite. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Oh, with that, uh, I, that's all the time we have for today, so uh, tomorrow we will go to the journey to the surface. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.